Hello, I'm Jarmo's Frog and I'm ready to rock, reeling off rhymes to blow your minds. Well, maybe not, but come on, it's not every day you see a cack-handedly computer-animated frog hand puppet reciting original limericks for Bob's sake. Personally, I think it's a transparent and frankly demeaning attempt to popularise a dying artistic form, but ours is not to question. Or maybe it is. So, shall we kick off with a bit of philosophy and science? Uh, this one's called Relatively Eternal. Albert Einstein realised Time's a dimension disguised Where all our lives stretch between birth date and death So, relatively, no one dies yeah. That was deep, wasn't it? I'm not normally deep, I'm normally quite crude. This one is more my style, it's called Moly Communion. A man with a mole on his member said, It's been there since September. How it got there, who knows? Nor do I suppose the shrew up my flu will remember. Hmm, you like that one? Or maybe you're more of a, a literary bent. Uh, I can do literary. You, you heard of Edward Lear? Yeah, heard of Edward Lear? Down in the pussycat bloke? He, he also popularised the limerick form, don't you know? The limericist Edward Lear is thought the form's prime pioneer. But all his last lines reused the same rhymes. That lazy old cunt, Mr Lear. Yeah. Maybe that was a bit crude as well. It was literary, though, don't you think? Perhaps I should mind my language. It's a funny thing, language. It's nonsense, as Edward Lear might have said. This one, for example, is called Y-O-Y. But I'm spelling the O in there. O-U-G-H, as in the word dough. Why say slough, slough, and not slough? When it's enough, rough and chuff. And why cough, not cuff? Or though, and not thuff? Oh, this language is toe, tow, tough, tough. My last limerick today deals with the topic of consenting into marital relationships, a.k.a. wife swapping or swinging, which I understand is quite popular with bored suburban city types. This one's called Share Collapse. A stockbroker from Hemel Hempstead, when asked would he swing, said, I'm tempted, adding on sight of his neighbour's nude wife, oh, I must go though, uh, bins need to be emptied. So, that's your lot for today. I'm off to uh, tickle me tadpole. See ya.